Among the pantheon of modern myths and legend, few artifacts have sparked as much unease as the crying boy painting. A seemingly innocent portrayal of a tearful child became the center of an urban legend so compelling that it captured the attention of a nation, mixing art with the supernatural. The Crying Boy is a mass-produced print, one of many painted by Italian artist Giovanni Bragolin in the mid-20th century. The legend ignited in the 1980s when a series of house fires across England left buildings in ruins. Yet, amidst the ashes, the Crying Boy prints were found unscathed. This eerie phenomenon led to whispers of a curse, with many believing that owning a copy of the painting invited disaster, particularly fire, upon one's home. The story gained prominence after a British tabloid published an article about a couple who lost their home to a fire, allegedly after acquiring one of the prints. As more stories of similar incidents spread, the myth of the crying boy took on a life of its own, fueling superstition and fear. The legend has become a cautionary tale about the objects we bring into our homes and their unseen effects. It has been discussed in numerous television programs, articles, and online forums, often cited as an example of modern folklore in the age of mass media. While countless owners of the paintings have lived without incident, a few unexplained cases of fire-related misfortune have been enough to sustain the myth's life force. For those who believe, the crying boy remains a symbol of bad luck and misfortune. Skeptics argue that the supposed curse is a result of confirmation bias and coincidence. Investigations into the fires found no evidence linking the prints to the cause of the blazes. Some have suggested that the prints' materials were treated with a fire retardant substance, which could explain why they often survived when much of the house did not. The story of the crying boy stands as a testament to the human penchant for storytelling and the power of myth. It blurs the lines between reality and superstition, between the tangible world and the ethereal realms of belief. Whether a cursed relic or a mere victim of circumstance, the painting's legacy continues to provoke both skepticism and belief. As you gaze upon art, one might wonder if it's merely the brushstrokes we see, or if there's something more, something that stirs the soul to tears or fear. Share your own stories of The Crying Boy and the art that moves you, perhaps more than you'd expect.